secondary is progressing it's with two DB coaches, communication improving? I mean, what's going on back there? Well, the communication is improving. Um, again, Coach Coach Levitt threw a lot at these guys. You know, he threw the whole package in. And, and now it's, again, just going over and over with our guys. So you expect a lot of um, uh, mistakes. You know, early, you know, now as we continue to go on through screen ball, you want to see those mistakes get corrected. Um, and, and for us as coaches, we, the defensive coaches, we threw it all out there. Let's see what sticks and, and let's build off of it again so we can say we're pretty good at something at the end of spring ball and, and build, off, build off of it when spring ball is over with. But I think our guys are competing and trying to do their best to act what we're doing. And, and offensively, some of the things we're doing is not, um, not easy to, to just go out there and try to pick up, especially when we're throwing a lot at those guys. Um, a lot of things we're doing offensively is pretty difficult. So, um, but they're they're making improvement and guys are competing. What was your evaluation of Herbert in that in that scrimmage and what he needs to work on moving um, forward? Just like everyone else, he did some good things and he did some bad things. You know, and you expect that it gives a new offense and um, and so he's going to make some mistakes here and there. Again, we don't want to start scrimmage off with interception. We don't want interception anyways, but. Um, but just like the rest of the guys, there's some things, some misreads that he had in the game that he can be better at. And, but it was good to see him bounce back after some of those mistakes. You know, so um, he's got to continue to improve with, with our guys. Just again, understanding the offense, managing the game. You know, um, I think there's times where we're trying to go for the big play all the time, when we can take the easy, easy play there, and we have some good, good backs that we can get it in their hands and let them do what they do best. And, and that just come with time, and again, we want those guys to be able to manage the football game. Freeland's a guy that seems like he's made a lot of plays for you at tight end. What's your evaluation seven, seven days in for? Um, he's, he's, I like Breland. I like him a lot, and um, want him to continue to improve. But he's, like you say, he's making plays consistently, and it's kind of easy to make plays when you're wide open too sometimes. So, but he made um, a really nice play in the back of the end zone on, on Saturday that I thought was uh, big time, you know. And Justin threw a nice ball to him as well. So, um, but he's, he's he's making plays, especially in the past game, and we, we want him to continue to um, get better in the run blocking. How does Cam and, and Matt Mariota perform behind him? Uh, Matt Matt was doing well. He he got injured um, on Friday. He was doing um, really good up to that point. Um, I think Matt can be um, very productive in our offense, and and Cam's coming along slowly but surely. He's making some plays as well. You talked about getting on the same page not only with your players but your coaches, some of whom you haven't worked with. In terms of Cristobal and Arroyo, who you know you were looking really closely with them to get this offense going, how do you guys get on the same page this last two or three months to make sure when you come out you're speaking with one voice? Um, I mean, we're doing that in the meeting rooms. You know, we're doing that when we sit down and meet and make sure we all understand what we're trying to get out of practice, what we're trying to get out of the plays that we're running, and making sure everybody understands exactly what we're doing. You know, but those guys have been great in, in the meeting room. They've been great working together and, and communicating and. Uh, I think that that progress is, is happening um, actually better than I anticipated, you know. But I think it's because they both um, don't have big egos and they want to learn and, and excited about learning. And, and then um, they're excited about being here and, and excited about coaching our guys and getting them to the same point. But um, those guys have been doing a good job at it. The Royals said to build chemistry between him and Cristobal, they ride together in the morning in the same car. Do you join that carpool? No, I'm not with that. No, <laughs> no, no, I'm not riding with those guys. They, they're riding together. I'm riding with them when we at work, you know, but um, they do a good job. They even go eat ice cream together. That's pretty cool. <laughs> okay. Coach, you turn, hired Coach Levin to turn the defense around. What is he like? Is he everything you expected and more? And what are your expectations for that defense? Um, he is everything I expected, you know. Um, Coach, Coach Levin is very passionate about what he does, you know, and um, he's very encouraging. He's not... Um, beating our guys down, he's encouraging, but being demeaning, I mean, being uh, demanding uh, of what he wants there, and um, he's enthusiastic every day. You all see that every single day, and that's how he is in meeting in the hallways. Um, and what we expect out of him is improvement. You know, like we expect improvement out of our entire football team, just to get better than we were the day before. Really exciting period maybe coming. What would be your thoughts on being able to do that and then kind of expanding the recruiting into kind of later times too? I um, just want to sign some guys if we can. You find that you don't mind if you if it's split up now into kind of an early one like basketball has and then I mean to... I really don't get caught up in it. I just try to do I I thought the old system worked pretty well, yeah. you know, for anyone to have questions or, or or worried about that, I think it's all just Someone, some people just get tired of some things and just won't change. But I, I didn't see anything wrong with the old system. You know, kids are enjoying it, and and um, it, and they should, they rightfully so. I mean, they got an opportunity to go off to school, and 
um, get a scholarship. So um, I didn't see anything with the uh, old system, wrong with the old system. So I have really, the new system, I don't know, hopefully it works. Just adjust to it and do whatever you Exactly, that's all we can do. do. I try not to get caught up in all those things. Control the controllables. <laughs>